Okay, so today we're going to be learning to count objects to 20 by making a group of 10, and it's going to help us recognise our team numbers. So, I've got some apples on the board, but I'm not sure how many apples I've got. I could start counting from 1. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. But counting from one takes quite a long time. So today we're going to be thinking about making a group of 10 and then counting on the ones that are left to make our counting faster. So first of all, I need to look for my group of 10. I've got five apples along the top here and I know that another five makes 10 because I'm thinking about my number bonds. So I've got a group of 10 here and two more apples here. I'm going to count on from 10, 10, 11, 12. So I've got 12 apples altogether, one group of 10 and two ones. 12 is one 10 and two ones. 10 and two make 12. Now I've got some blueberries. I need to count these blueberries as well. I don't want to start counting at one because there's quite a few blueberries and that's going to take me a long time. So I'm going to look for a group of 10 and I can see a pattern in the blueberries. I can see that there's a pattern of five here and a pattern of five here. And if I think about my number bonds, I know that five and five make 10. So there's my group of 10. So I've got one group of 10 and I'm going to count on the rest of the blueberries. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. So I've got one group of 10 and four ones, which makes 14, 14 blueberries. 10 and four make 14. 14 is 10 and four. You can have a go at um, counting on to count all the other team numbers up to 20.